My name is Sarah Jane Ward. I'm an assistant professor at the Lewis Katz School of Medicine at Temple University. I'm in the Center for Substance Abuse Research, also in the Department of Pharmacology. My research that I do at Temple is using animal models to study the safety and efficacy of molecules from the cannabis plant. For many of the therapeutic targets that we investigate in the laboratory, there are not very many treatment options available. And for some of the um, disorders that we're investigating in the laboratory, such as chemotherapy-induced neuropathic pain, for example, there are currently no FDA approved um, treatments for for this disease. We think it's really important to do some um, good basic science research to see if this is a viable treatment option that can be approved. At the 2017 uh, CanMed conference I plan to share some of the research that I've been conducting over the last several years at Temple um, in my own laboratory in collaboration with many other scientists here uh, specifically investigating the therapeutic potential of different components of the plant for the treatment of various CNS disorders that specifically have an inflammatory component to them. Uh, some of the topics that I'll be talking about are um, our results in animal models of chronic pain as well as animal models of spinal cord injury, uh, traumatic brain injury, and stroke. One of the reasons to attend conferences like the Can Med Conference are to really um, get an appreciation for how much research is going on in the area of medical cannabis. It's one thing I'm um, surprised about when I talk to people who are outside of the basic science field. They're unaware that there is so much research going on both at the basic science and clinical um, level to understand the safety concerns associated with medical cannabis as well as the um, potential therapeutic efficacy that we're discovering in our research. As a substance abuse researcher, I had my own concerns about the abuse liability of marijuana or different therapeutics based off of marijuana. And through attending many scientific conferences, talking to colleagues, reading scientific articles, it's definitely shifted my opinions. And really, I think almost every time I talk to people, other scientists, other people in the general population, when, when people are exposed to the kind of research that is going on and the kind of results that are being obtained, I think uh, by and large, people's um, attitudes are shifted or certainly their, their minds are opened. Thank you.